Hey guys, my name is Nicole. Welcome back to my channel. Right now you are looking at everything that I have ready to go into my antique booth. Green Onion Vintage. I'm getting ready to do a big reset, take out all of my old summer items that did not sell, and go right into the upcoming fall season. So most of these were projects I just did in a recent DIY video. Um, just kind of assembling some things for fall, doing some upcycling projects, and I also have some antiques mixed in that I've been buying over the year getting ready for this fall season so it is time for me to price everything right now and load up and I'm heading up to my first booth which is at my treasure house in Edwardsville Illinois So here's kind of a before look at the booth. I have carried in some of my new items, so just ignore those if you see like that scale right there. I just brought that in. But I'm kind of just taking in how the booth looks right now, trying to see if there's anything that I need to edit out that's no longer appropriate for fall. Um, it doesn't look too bad right now. I can see that my mom has already brought in um, some of her fall stuff, so if you're a little confused about why there's already fall in there, I do this booth with my mom and she had already brought her stuff in that day she was working today that's why I said hi to her up at the front desk um, so now I'm just gonna go through and pick out the things that are obviously not fall I'll either store these away maybe sell them in my other booth or sometimes if I just feel like it's not worth it for me to store it I'll donate it I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with these items yet most likely just store everything um, and then once I have everything taken out that is blatantly not fall I'm going to start creating my vignettes with the new items that I just brought in for autumn and this is my absolute favorite part is bringing back in some new pieces, working them into my booth and creating just some new things for my customers to see because we do get a lot of like regular shoppers at this store. So even if you don't bring in new items, it's really important just for me to kind of shuffle things around and kind of create some new things for my customers to see and sometimes a lot of times we'll actually see things that they didn't notice before. So it's always a treat for me to have some time to come in here and work the booth. I don't get that very often anymore, so I really enjoy it when I do get up here. And I hope you enjoy kind of watching the process as I go through my booth and make everything look nice and pretty. Okay, so that is it for this first booth rework for fall. Uh, there's definitely more work to be done here and a lot more fall inventory to bring in. But this is a really solid start. And now I'm just going to take you through the booth and kind of show you my favorite pieces. Show you some of the prices because I know you guys are from around the country and around the world. So you kind of like to know like what things sell for. In this. this is my treasure house in Edwardsville, Illinois. So we're right outside of the St. Louis, Missouri area. 
Um, so, you know, kind of the heart of the Midwest there. And I know that things sell for very different prices in other parts of the country. So um, I do kind of like to show you guys what things are selling for. As far as how I rearrange the booth, I try to, you know, make similar color stories, lots of, lots of greens. And if I have multiple things, I try to put them together. So it's just a little bit easier for the shopper to kind of look through a little easier on the eye. I think that always makes a booth look more put together um, when you kind of have your colors in a similar area. So I'm going to let you guys kind of look through with me and uh, let me know down in the comments below as you're watching if there's anything that sticks out to you, anything that is your favorite, or if you'd like to see a price just, just for fun. I don't ship right now, unfortunately. But if you have any questions about anything, just let me know down in the comments below.
All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's fall booth tour. I definitely see where I am ready to get some of these pastel colored furniture pieces sold and really just embrace fall and all the darker colors and the darker wood. So if you would like to see how our booth continues to evolve during the holiday season, make sure that you subscribe and like this video. Before I leave, I always enter my booth from the front of the store and also from the back of the store because I want to see how it will look for a customer shopping who's walking either direction. And then I normally head out for the day after a solid hour or two of work. And that was just for a small rework, not even a large one. But I really enjoyed this process. Hope you enjoy being here too. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.